In this video, I'm going to show you how to navigate the Zoho Book system. Hey everyone, my name is Stephanie Smith and I'm a Zoho Finance Partner at AIO Bookkeeping. At AIO Bookkeeping, we help business owners do business better by getting their bookkeeping in order and reconnecting them with their business finances. Thanks for joining us on our YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Now let's dive in. What I'd like to do is give you a little tour of the Zoho Books system so you are more familiar with everything that's here and you know where to go to do the things you need to do. First, I want to say is the panel over here on the left hand side, which you can collapse and expand is going to be your main navigation panel to the various places within Zoho Books. The first uh, option here is your dashboard. The dashboard will give you a clear picture of your company's finances. It gives you an overview of your total receivables, total payables, cash flow, income and expenses, etc. Uh, there's no data in my system right now because I just signed up, so there's nothing here, but this will be a, a great place to start just to get a high level view of your finances. The next item down are your items. Items are going to be the goods or services that you sell in your organization and you can add your items here. The next one is banking and this is where you're gonna connect your bank and credit card accounts and get all of your transactions to categorize and import and input into your books here. In the next section, you'll see sales. This is where you can put in your customers, your invoices, you can um, receive payments and see everything related to sales in this section. The next section is purchases. So if you're going to be putting bills in here and your expenses, what vendors that you purchase from, all of that will, will fall into this section. The following section is time tracking. The timesheets module is for businesses that charge their customers based on the time spent in finishing a project. You can record time using timesheets and bill your customers for the projects you, rec you create for them. Um, so you'll be able to track projects and time in this section here. Your accountant section will have um, more of the accounting side of things with your chart of accounts. You can add manual journal entries um, and you can set your budget all in this section. The following section is your reports. This is where you can run and view your main reports, profit and loss, cash flow statement, balance sheet, as well as other reports like your accounts receivable aging um, and sales reports. There is a documents section here in Zoho Books where you can upload your receipts and uh, bills and you can actually attach those to your transaction. So that's where you would find all of your documents. Other things to note is there is a plus sign here for a quick create. This is going to be a quick way to add various things into the systems like invoices, items, everything we just talked about, bills, vendors. You can use any of these quick, quick links to add things into the system. The recent activities option right next to that will show you all the recent things that you've looked at. So if you're wanting to quickly go back to something you just reviewed, you'll find it there. You can search for anything in the system, whether that's customers, your amounts. Um, I use the search function a lot. If I'm looking for specific transactions, I can type in the amount or I can type in the customer's name and that will take me where I need to go. Uh, you can also change your settings under this settings cog over here. So you can see your organization settings, your preferences. You can actually set up templates and email templates as well as set up your integrations and see what subscription level you have. So this is where you're gonna set up all of your company settings. There is a help and support option, which is great if you're ever looking to chat with an expert or get some help or walk through any of their documentation, this is where you would find that. And then um, your icon itself is where you can set up your main profile and just see your organization and your actual account. And that is the main overview of the Zoho Books system. There is a lot to go through in each of these sections. So um, catch one of my other videos and I will go into detail in a lot of these on how to use the system so you can feel confident about using Zoho Books for your business.